We're going to be doing each room as a different Sims YouTuber. Ah, sh her voice is really loud. I'm not doing that. Sorry. Why did I click new game? I hate it here. Why did I do this to myself? We're just gonna go on new crest because new crest is like the easiest place to build and I'm not fucking about with that. I might even do just a... Oh, do I do a small house? Am I being a cop out? Yes, I am. I am. Yeah, I am gonna be a cop out. I am gonna make life easier for myself. Also, just a little side note. I do be loving these little additions that they added in with the most recent update. Llama Lagoon sounds like my kind of place with lakeside walkways and public playground equipment. This neighborhood is just the right amount of cosmopolitan. I haven't actually read these, you know. This busy strip of real estate lying in the streets of New Crest suburbs boasts ample hiking trails. Hiking in New Crest. And get to fuck with that. This family friendly neighborhood has a lovely picnic area and a striking skyline backdrop. Love that for us. I also need to make sure that there's not a fire in this one because I still have the mod installed for the <laughs> when I tried to kill every sim in The Sims 4 and the fire just completely ruined my entire game. I still have all the mods installed so I feel like my, my living rooms are always like the front left and I kind of want it to turn this house on its side a little bit. Steph is just gonna have to be chaotic as fuck. Like I'm gonna have to know well in advance which room Steph is. Steph can have the bedroom I think ah, should Steph have the bedroom or should I give Steph the toilet I'm gonna make it a little bit bigger I kind of want to give Kayla the living room because I know Kayla's living room style quite well I'm gonna do like a kitchen dining area place there is this am I just am I making a box I might turn this house on its side I don't know what I'm doing to it but it's a thing it exists it's demanding presence oh I also have custom content as well <gasps> this is gonna be so much fun loves Vixel is gonna be the kitchen which is gonna be this little area here so this is gonna be Kayla's bit the entranceway is gonna be there the bedroom's gonna be here James I'm sorry Henny you were getting the toilet Steph you've got the bedroom it's a one bedroom property right it's a young millennial couple it's the first home and one of them is a part-time honeymaker i don't know which kind of show we're watching right now some on that hgtv oh hi thanks for checking in i'm not american so we're gonna focus on the inside first <laughs> that's the plan that we're gonna go for that is a big kitchen yes but maybe they're just cooking a lot of things you don't need to judge this couple you don't know how hungry they are we do all get a little bit peckish from time to time I'm a boss ass. We're getting, we're getting, we're getting, we're getting. Hey guys, James here today. I feel kind of bad that I'm putting James in the bathroom. Do I give him a... No, you know what, James? I'm sorry. You don't get a big bathroom. <laughs> we'll do James Turner's room first. Honestly, just because it's the smallest and I hate... I'm not going to say James Turner there, so don't be thinking that there's YouTube beef. I just hate bathrooms. And that's also not why I've given James this room. <laughs> right, so James, honestly, like, his stereotype is black and white. And I hope I'm not offending him with this. And I may potentially use custom content, even if the YouTuber themselves doesn't use it because i'm all about taking risks honey james don't you worry honey i have got you big fat covered it is a-okay we are not necessarily thriving but we are styling is he one for privacy who's to know not me james don't worry honey you're getting a three by two luxurious bathroom oh i'm shite with wallpaper are we ready for my daily breakdown i can see him using them listen james i'm not saying you're missing any personality you have room this plane but if the shoe fits lovey a jest i jest and I just want to reiterate that I jest. <laughs> I am going to put some accessories. There you go. Hand sanitizer. And there you go, James. Don't say I don't treat you, lovey. We created something so unique that players just could not handle it. Give you something nice to wipe your ass with. <laughs> James, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Is it weird to have a radiator above the toilet? Nah, don't judge me. I won't judge you. It's fine. It's fine. I'm going to carry on. I see. I'm always humming and ahhing over curtains because in the one sense, for me, I'm like, nah, they do deserve a curtain. And then in the other sense, I'm like, the Sims... A sim is not going to knock on the window and be like, I can see you taking a shit there, lovey. Better wipe all... Ra That's not going to happen in The Sims. At what point am I trying to be too realistic, you know? Where do I put a plant, though? Really, aesthetically, can I fit a plant in, in this bathroom? Maybe if I get rid of that in the bath and we have one of these. Or if we have a wall one. A hanging one. <gasps> oh, a hanging. A hanging. Yes. You know what? Above there. Nice view. If you have a board and you're taking away, just... Just look up in this bathroom. Sometimes rationality may be the best <laughs> route for me to go down. <laughs> Do you think James would appreciate custom content light switch? I can't find it anyway. So James, I don't... <gasps> a towel. Oh, this is kind of cute. But it takes up some... You know what? Back of the door. There we go. James Turner. Following known to Sim Supply. Your room is big fat done, my lovely. There you go. You can see for plants. But I mean, I'm sure that that's the aesthetic design that you would prefer to go down. So... I'm a we're getting, we're getting, we're getting, we're getting. 
the internet has ruined me. The two main styles that are stuck in my head for her are like this kind of cute style. Hang on, let me get it. Wherefore art thou? Has it, has it gone? Like this kind of style cute, but I also see her like with the vintage glamour kind of twang. See, I'm kind of scared now because like I don't want to offend anyone. I don't want any of the YouTubers to watch this and be like, that is not my style, bitch. That is not my style. Right, and we'll do three of them. I thought I had enough room. Do I not have enough room? Because I also wanted to include a little dining table. The end pieces of islands. Yes. I say yes as if it's this groundbreaking thing when the reality is I'm just a bit of an idiot. Is that Vixella? Because I, I kind of associate vintage glamour stuff with her forever now because of her each room's a different pack challenge. So now because of, of that, like my mind's just like, like, that is her forever. I'm sorry, Sasha, you can never change. Right, so we'll do that. And then also, windows, windows, windows. See, because there's like planter boxes and stuff, I want to do that kind of thing. You know what? I don't care if this is slightly weird to put into a kitchen. Sasha, I'm building your dream home here, honey. <laughs> I'm just going to sort. Jungle adventure. You're getting it all, honey. You're getting it all. This is actually kind of stressful because I'm friends with these people. So like, this could end friendships. If we do a white swatch instead of the, the, the brown, we can like kind of brighten it up a little bit. Do I have it? I'm tr really trying to think if I have enough room. I think I might have to scooch that over here. And then in this bit, we can do the, whatchamacallit, where is she? There she blows. Sasha, honey, I'm so sorry if I'm offending you right now. <laughs> I thought it would be easier. I thought this would be easier. Right, no, I'm just leaving it as that because I'm stressing myself out and I can't afford a mental breakdown, lovies. I really can't. And then for a table, I'm thinking a big circle one. I want to do a circle table. My senses are telling me. I mean, my senses are lately let's not lie loves but my senses are telling me to put a big circle table right that is a lot of chairs like for two people who are they i don't know how sociable this family is and then i might do i don't know how sasha this is but i might do an archway but i think that the archway might just be for me you know to make me feel more comfortable <laughs> right and then i'm just gonna plant it out like mad oh my Girl, don't do it. It's not worth it. Don't be shy. Don't be shy. Come on. I'm just thinking about it. I'm not going to do it. Jesus, thank the Lord. I do actually need to save the game. I've, I've broke my game with all my mods recently, so it's just not going well. Oh, that's cute. Does it go necessarily in the middle of the table? No, not 100%, but it's, we are vibing. <laughs> I'm shit with rugs. It's not my... I don't do them, sorry. So I don't think I'm ever going to pick the right rug. So I'm just putting that one. There we go. That's that. Don't fight me. Don't fight me because I'm not willing to fight. I can't want to put a bed in here but like sasha's dog's quite big there we go oh that's kind of cute God, listen not that i'm getting emotional over shite but I, i'm putting this because i could just imagine sasha just like writing little messages for a dog but like Good night, sleep tight, love you. That room's kind of cute and I'm very happy with it. So, Sasha, I hope you are too. <laughs> Sasha will be in my inbox and like, this is my somebody with big, fat, white, nasty, smelling fat, bitch. <laughs> I'm warning you right now, this is the dumbest one yet. Right, now for Kayla. I'm going to take Kayla's back to like 2017 YouTube because that's how I know the most. There's a city that I associate with Kayla a lot. I've seen her use it at least once. So for me, that's like, yeah, well, it's a favourite city, isn't it? Because that's just how my mind works, Louise. Addictive personality. This is how it presents. This one. Is it this swatch? I think it's that swatch or that swatch. I'll do that. Kayla has also got a very good natural placement of chairs. I don't. Like, Kayla just knows where to put a chair. What's that like? <laughs> oh, actually, no. Kayla's would be a long one. Don't take that one out of context, please. Thank you. These windows. Kayla also used to love these plants. So there you go, Kayla, honey. Don't say I don't treat you. These kind of wallpapers are all very Kayla to me. This is just Kayla. I'm not tooting my own horn, but hi, Kayla. How you doing? Because I can see you sitting in this room right now. What you been up to? I've been missing you. I don't think this rug necessarily goes with this room the most, but I'm going to put it in anyway. Fun fact for you as well. Kayla is actually the reason I started YouTube. Not to get sentimental or out, but yes. Oh, actually, we need a front door. I'm like, nobody's getting access to this house. Nah, bitch. One of these. James Turner's door does not. <laughs> it does not suit with the rest of the room. Kayla loves to shot like an office about the place as well, so I have noticed. Nothing gets past these eyes, Kayla. She's shuddering at the placement of this door next to this desk. I'm telling you that one for free. How are you getting in the bedroom? Oh, <gasps> Because this is Steph's room. It will be quite on brand to just like a fully fucking chaotic entrance into that room you know we'll put a sconce on the wall just to fill up this kind of area pretty bare right now honestly maybe like reusing this again just to put it in the back that swatch does not match right i am gonna have to put in the cow plant poster because justice for cow plants although i say 
Copeland. Justice for Born Hilda. Where is she? Nobody seen her. Does anybody know where Born Hilda is? Justice for Born Hilda. Okay, I'll put a cat tower as well. I'm only gonna put a small one though, not for animal abuse or out like that, but like just for size. I'm a boss ass. We're getting, we're getting, we're getting, we're getting. Did I turn out like this? I have a plan for Steph's room. I'm gonna give her a desk here to work on with a computer. Okay, and this is gonna be Steph's put together part of a bedroom. Steph, what chair have you got? Thank you. All. Maybe like that, because I know that Steph likes that colour blue. I don't know what I put behind it. Oh, that's kind of Steph. I could just imagine her having a mural. Love that. Love that. And then I just want to divide the room up because then behind here is where all the shit happens. It is a bedroom, but I'm kind of wishing that I didn't do this as a bedroom because I have so many plans now. What bed should I give Steph? Get Famous is her favourite pack. So I'm going to have to give her a princess bed. Hey, Jesse. Steph does not deserve windows. Thank you. <laughs> Steph would most definitely have a slide in her bedroom given the opportunity and she'd put a plan on it. There you go, Steph. Love you, hun. And I'm going to give her some fairy lights. Here is pictures of me, Steph and Molly. I am missing you all. Do I get Steph? I feel like I am going to have to give you a door though. So you can like, I don't want to lock you in it, you know. I'm just thinking like, what door would Steph love? A pet door? Maybe. Do I go pretty? Because that could be cool if I put a curtain over it. Nah, no, pet door. <laughs> Oh my god, the Get Famous VIP door. Where is it? Where is it, bitch? <laughs> in the words of Steph, all Sims only hitch two holes are coming in here thanking you. Oh, but I, what I want most is like the photography studio. But I don't know where it is. I've been spoiled right. Because there's this search bar thing. I no longer look through categories for like very specific things. I just zoom through. She's zooming, dude. Right, I need the camera. And I'm also going to give her a big brother chair. <gasps> Oh, this is... Oh, no. She deserves better. Oh, that ghost is kind of cute. I don't know if you want it, Steph, but there you go. It's there for you. I'm going to give her a mixture of pink and purple because me and Steph's favourite hobby is to dye our hair pink and then dye our hair purple and then go back to the pink. So that's that. <laughs> I'm going to give her this carpet, right, because everybody else has got wood, but this carpet reminds me of... Not that I have had this carpet, but when I look at this carpet, I just feel like I'm a bairn again. Approximately eight years of age and i'm looking at my polly pocket dead in the eye and thinking your clothes taste nice so that's why this is the carpet because me and steph used to nom nom on polly pocket clothes i think steph also used to suck a sponge in the bath so that's that it's not happening guys and then the last place is rt games rt games why is it plural <laughs> right if anybody knows um rt game which i'm sure that you all do great man truly but the thing is he can't build for the life of him. Not even in the slightest. No offence. So today I am going to just do an RT and the outside is all going to be, oh God, James Turner's the only one that's got a window. And then he does also like to fuck about with these terraforming tools. Could never be me. But he does like to see how far he can push it. Oh God, the flamingos are floating. This makes me so uncomfortable. Put the cooking mama baby on the roof. Oh my good God. First off, I need the roof. Oh Jesus, it's so him. Baby, there we go. Look at him. <laughs> Look at this like, Hey, bitch. <laughs> so for the final tour, the outside of the house is Raniel Taniel rootin' tootin' games. He doesn't know what wallpaper is, apparently. Somebody help this man. Oh, God, the flamingos did go down. I hope I have not killed him, you know. That wouldn't be very vegan. And we've got the cooking mama baby on top. This room is Kayla's room. So obviously we've got the cow plant poster because she do be having a bit of an obsession. But I'm not wanting to judge because I do be a slag for Bonehilda. And we've got the very suburban living room area. In here is Sasha Vixella's room. Got a little dog bed and feeding station and little chalkboard so she can write notes to a dog because I love that. I, see, the thing is, with this, I'm like, I stretch realism, right? But then in the bathroom, I'm like, no, I'm not putting a curtain. It's the f***ing Sims. And then here, it's like, she can write a little note to a dog. Like, <laughs> Selective realism. That's my builds. <laughs> I did give Sasha loads of flowers and I tried to make it as cute as possible. Samaj's J oh god. Hey. Hey. Well, it's the room with the view, ladies. I gave him a nice black and white shower, a nice black and white toilet, a nice black and white sink, a nice black mirror, a nice white radiator. I you can sense the theme here. I did give him some nice toilet roll. That is most definitely four ply. And then Steph's room is she's got a, a professional thing here where she makes videos and, and the like. And then we've got a recording set up here so she can do a Nikki Graham Big Brother style confession. And we've got a bed, a plant on a slide because she'd love a slide. And a nice bed, because this is her favourite pack. I am going to put it on the gallery. No, I am. I am going to put it on the gallery. Each room 
different YouTuber. Well, you two. I don't know why you'd want to play it, but if you do want to play it, the option's there. I just want to know this baby's story. Like, is everything all right? What happened at home will lead us in this situation. The baby will be like, I'll tell you what fucking happened. That ran your time, you broken two game. That's illegal. You're going to get fucking arrested. Mm -hmm.